Alright TRLP, I wanted to come to you with a real quick video, not to take much of your time, but um, I had a message that I wanted to get across. Um, there's been discussion over which direction we want to take this TRLP Leadership Legacy Project. Um, at this point, uh, I'd say two choices have really stood out above the rest. One, um, do we support uh, Jamie's fight for rare cancer funding? Or two, uh, we, su we support raising at least $50,000 to have a room or something uh, named in our honor at the new cancer facility. So at this point, I wanted to uh, take a moment and share something with y'all that is personal and private amongst our group at this time. Um, but I received an email last night that, that really, truly moved me, and I'm going to share some of the words in that email with y'all. And I couldn't think of any other better way to do it than to just do a really quick, uh, unrehearsed video. Um, basically, I got an email from Jamie late last night, and um, her condition has turned for the worst. She's been a little quiet lately, and um, that's why she sent me the email. She wanted to, us to understand where things are with her so that we knew what was going on. I'm going to share some of the words now. I'm reading from her. The last few weeks have been very difficult. At this point, my cancer is inoperable, and there are no known effective treatment options. Chemo has never been shown to be effective for my type of cancer. We recently found out that it has spread to my lymph nodes, and the whole plan has changed. Since my cancer is so rare, there is little research and or treatment options. I have been working with attorneys and a CPA firm who are donating their services to start a nonprofit to fund research at MD Anderson for this type of cancer. I have also been working with the business development office at MD Anderson and my doctors to find the most effective way to start research there. The hope is that eventually my type of cancer will respond to some form of chemo. The nonprofit we are in the process of starting is Jamie's Hope. I'm going to start posting everything soon on Facebook and Twitter throughout every experience I'll be going through for cancer treatment. I have found that focusing my energy on something positive has really helped. I just hope that I can make a difference. My heart is in this 100% and the responses I have already received are amazing. Sorry I have been so quiet lately with responding. It has been an extremely emotional time for me and my family and we have been spending as, spending as much time as possible together until everything begins. Um, Jamie has also said in a second email that she has been meeting extensively with MD Anderson. She has spoken with a lady by the name of, or she's been meeting with, working with a lady named Robin Trout, who's the assistant director of business development at MD Anderson. Uh, basically, anyone that gets in this, uh, that helps donate or fundraise for this cause, uh, they're going to let them come in, tour the research facilities, get to know personally where the money's going, what's happening, and what, we're, what, the, what the cause is benefiting. Um, with that being said, seriously, what, what greater honor is there than, um, and what better legacy could we leave than saying that we fought for one of our own? Um, you know, J Jamie's cancer may not be one that's affecting millions or thousands or, or hundreds of thousands of people across the world or here in Houston, but um, her condition is affecting her and the ones around her. In the short time that we've gotten to know her, she's become a part of our family. And um, I feel that TRLP is our family. We're a bunch of brothers and sisters. And, um, and one of us is down right now. And so uh, what if we could say that we were instrumental in, um, in, in, in helping start Jamie's Hope. And uh, where eventually a treatment could be found for her and future victims of this horrible disease. Um, either cause is good, and both are going to benefit people in the long run. Um, so, But I know that I can personally rally up support, love, and passion when I'm fighting for someone that I personally know. Um, in my opinion, the Legacy Project is no longer about us making an impact uh, that other people can take notes from or whatnot, it's, it's gotten way deeper than that now. I think we're a passionate group, and we have the chance to make amazing strides, not only amongst HAR and TRLP, but now we can make amazing strides amongst ourselves, amongst uh, one of our own. And so um, 
This is about supporting our colleague, our friend, our sister, our Jamie. So I wanted y'all to know where she's at, what's going on, and as project manager, I'm putting my vote to make this legacy project about keeping Jamie around. I, I don't think there's any greater legacy. And um, so with that being said, I'll let you go.